Our elephant has moved on now. He's decided he needs a bit of grass. Grass roots. Cellulose. Really distasteful breakfast. Hello, Sarah. Elephant's favorite food is Oreos. That's their very favorite. They like Oreos, but they are difficult to get around here. And during lockdown, there's definitely been a shortage of Oreos. And so what they have to make do with at the moment is, uh, is grass and leaves. Obviously, that's not true, Sarah. Their favorite food, I would say, is marula fruits. And they get those in this particular area in January and February. So they'll have to wait for the marula trees to fruit later on in the season. So after the rains, normally. But in some parts of the country, they fruit in December. So it depends where the elephants or where they are, where the trees are. Not so much the elephants. And the elephants will move to wherever the trees are fruiting. But they absolutely go wild for marula fruits. And interestingly, they also go fairly wild for uh, citrus, which they don't get naturally but they will seek it out if they can get it. And I've been to a place in Zimbabwe, close to the corner, I've forgotten what the corner's called now, the corner between Zimbabwe, Botswana and South Africa, where there is a big citrus farm on the river there, and they put out, I don't know, trailer loads of citrus fruits periodically when, you know, uh, the stuff rots or they can't send it out or it's got nicks in the skin. I don't know why they do it. Anyway, trailer loads of the stuff in front of one of their lodges. And it's not in a, it's not in a national park or anything, but there, there are no fences between them and the national park. And the elephants come and they eat the citrus along with the baboons and they sit there. It's quite amusing to watch. I'm not sure how good it is for them, however. I don't know if it's uh, very good to be eating that much sugar if your body hasn't been designed to consume that much sugar. Anyway, they do like it. <laughs> 